guys welcome back to my channel i just got my first pumpkin spice latte of the year it's so good i used to literally have one of these like every single day and they gave us like a free bag like a free school goodie bag or something so kingston's gonna do an unboxing for you they gave us twisted pretzel sticks i don't know why sanitizing stuff and then these weird trolley Sour crunchy crawlers. I don't know. Mom would never let us bring that to school. Peanut butter bars. Maybe Savannah can eat those. Uh, Flex and Seal. Three sample bags. Fruit Bites. Multivitamin Woman's. <laughs> perfect for me. Lumify. How does this have anything to do with school? <laughs> they gave us toothpaste <laughs> for school. <laughs> well, cheese yeah, fruit snacks. Wine to get into home set. Oh, sweet Haribo Gold Bear. There's like three of them. <laughs> Why is there a wine? This is terrible. Uh, granola bars, RX bar. It's going pretty good. And then some more granola bars. Oh, Mentos Pure Mint. Oh, sweet! Albany's gummy bears. And then there's almond butter, Justin's <gasps> classic. Oh my! And then Sour Patch Kids and Ultimate gummy bears. Come on, guys. We gotta and go that's pretty much it. Hey guys, so I, this is like a bad angle, but it's okay. I just went to um, the store. We went to Home Goods and Target. And I wanted to show you guys what I got. I only got a couple things. I got these beauty blenders, and then I got this is so cute. I got this from Home Goods. It's like a little pillow with skeletons, like doing yoga. So I can't wait to like put this on my bed and decorate for fall. And then I got this package, um, which I am gonna open right now, and I'll show you guys in another video what it is because I'm filming a back to school haul. So. This will be in it. Hi, can I get a six piece chicken nugget with fries and a medium vanilla frosty? Hey guys, so I am at my house right now. It is a couple days later. I look slightly crazy. Um, it's 1.14 right now. My friend is picking me up at 1.45, so we're gonna go thrifting. I'm having some coffee right now. I tried to make a pumpkin spice latte, but um, it tastes like pretty pumpkin spicy. I just used some cold brew and then some coffee that I had made. And I put it in a glass and then I put in a separate mug milk, like oat milk, cinnamon, lemon pie spice, some turmeric, and this pumpkin spice syrup stuff that I got from Target. It's just pumpkin spice coffee syrup. And I put that all in like a glass together and I frothed it. So like I mix it together and it tastes pretty good. Like it doesn't taste like Starbucks good, but it's pretty good. Oh my gosh, I got cinnamon on my hoodie. Um, yeah, so we're going thrifting. I've been really into listening to, like, my cousin introduced me to some new music and my brother, and um, I've been listening to a lot of, like, Pop Smoke and Roddy Rich lately. They're so good. Um, that's just an update. I am going to, uh... Well, I have like a half hour, so I'm going to show you guys um, how I make these protein balls. I've literally, like I've been living off these the past couple days. I have these sometimes for breakfast or for lunch. Um, I normally only have two of them. Like I, I just had two of them for lunch today. The other day I had two of them for breakfast, but they're little protein balls. And they're so, so good. And they're like super simple. So let me show you guys. I make them because I want to make some for my mom's house and I just ran out of them for my dad's house hi baby and so I'm gonna show you guys how I make them so literally all you need are these four things um, you need rolled oats 
You need maple syrup and then you need peanut butter or well the recipe calls for sun butter but i don't have sun butter here i only have peanut butter so i'm gonna use that um normally i've used sun butter like every other time i made it but today we're using peanut butter and then you need chocolate chips or sometimes i do like espresso beans instead or something like that if you don't want like the chocolate chips but this is all you need so first what you're gonna do is you're gonna take one and three fourths cup of quick oats and you're gonna put it in a food processor or a blender i'm just gonna do a, a blender right now because i don't feel like taking out my food processor and doing that whole thing plus i have to leave in like 25 minutes so you're gonna put it in the blender i just did and i thought i was filming but i wasn't you're gonna do it until it's like a flour consistency um oh it smells so gross okay and then we're gonna do six tablespoons of maple syrup want to put the like flour that you made with the oat i guess if you have oat flour in a bag you can use that instead of like blending it in a food processor okay so i put the maple syrup in and then you're gonna put half a cup of peanut butter in i almost just took a sip out of this because i thought it was my coffee and then after the peanut butter you get to do your favorite part or my favorite part at least is half a cup of chocolate chips um dairy free chocolate chips are the way to go if you're like trying to make a vegan recipe which this recipe is vegan i'm using the trader joe's chocolate chips they're just semi-sweet chocolate chips this is what it should look like when you're done um so now you're just going to make it into little balls and put it on like a plate So these are them. We're just gonna go ahead and put them in the freezer and hope nobody opens the freezer because they're gonna come falling out. Hey guys, so I just got back from dinner and um, I have a lot of energy, but we're doing good. So I got a sweater and I was gonna show it to you guys, but I'm actually gonna wait for my back to school haul that I'm filming very soon because I got a couple new things for that. Um, but I did get this that I can show you. I got this candle. It's a Detox Bright Side Wax & Co. candle. It smells really good. It's eucalyptus and it's made out of soy and it has a cotton wick so it's non-toxic. I got, I got it from Francesca's and I also wanted to show you guys these rings that my friend Lily gave them to me. Aren't they so pretty? I love them. They just are like so cute and like dainty. Um, so yeah, that's what went on and I literally ate so much food like I'm not okay. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to go watch Selling Sunset with my family now. So I'm probably going to end off the vlog for today. I think I'm going to vlog tomorrow because I'm going to hang out with my friends again. And then I have like a Netflix party with my friends. So I'm not doing like a ton, but I might film like throughout the day like what I'm doing. Um, so yeah, that is probably all for today. Um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. It is the next day right now. I just got out of the shower. It's like, what time is it? 2.18. I had like a weird day today because I woke up at like 9.40 and I was planning on working out, showering, having coffee, you know, my morning routine. Um, but there was this ginormous, it was huge. It was literally like this big, like B in my house and it was in the hallway outside of my room. And I was literally terrified to go out of my room. So I stayed in my room until my brother woke up to ask him. I was like, Kingston, tell me where the um, bee is. And he was like, so it was in his room and my mom ended up getting it. We're all good. But I was too scared to leave my room. So I like cleaned and organized my room. It looks really different right now. I was going to do a video about that, but I was um, obviously like in my room this morning, like really bored because I was like not leaving my room. So... I did that and it looks good. I'm going to Ikea this weekend. I ordered these slippers from Pottery Barn and they finally came. They were the ones that Maggie McDonald, I don't know if any of you guys watch her, but if you do, they're the ones that she always talks about like being really good or whatever. And update, they were not really good. I mean, they were 
like 47 um and they just weren't that great of quality and then I realized like after I ordered them that I've never tried like the slippers that you like slip on I only have the ones that are like the L.L. Bean ones that are like um like kind of shoes like they surround the back of your foot too and so I wasn't sure how I was gonna like it and I didn't end up liking the slip on ones I just don't like having my feet exposed so that was kind of rough I definitely had to go return those because that was like a lot of money. But yeah, that's just what I've been doing today. I went for a walk and did my workout. I tried Paige Lorenz's workout today. The reason I'm talking to you guys right now is because I wanted to vlog. But also because I wanted to show you guys. I got this new product. So obviously you just saw me do like my hair care routine. I've done that already in a video. So I wasn't going to show you guys everything. But I got my FabFitFun box the other day. And I got this... Um, finish cream from such a one I don't know how to pronounce it so it's this finishing cream and basically you just put it on your hair when it's damp or dry and it like adds moisture and definition for a weightless shine so I'm just gonna do like that much yeah I look like a drowned rat right now but it's okay I played it over and over so that I'd be prepared for what happened. I'd know exactly what to say to my parents. Make sure they knew they didn't have to worry about me. I let them know that it's okay. I wasn't enough to 